I know. <laughs> his name. So, his name is Hay. His name's Hay. <laughs> right. This is Bailey. Bailey. There okay. you go. Yeah. So, um, just getting ready to walk off. Just flag your legs out. Okay. That's all. Just like that. Um, when you're getting ready, you know, before you walk off, set them up. You're just gonna you're gonna roll your spur. I'm exaggerating a little bit, but um, you're gonna roll your spur up his belly. Just slightly pick up with your hand. Um, Flag your legs after he gets rounded up. Have him walk off. Um, just to get him to trot, you're just going to cluck and outside leg bump on him a little bit. Um, if he needs to slow down, it's squeeze the whole leg. Stop is just the spur. Um, get him to lope off. She's going to lift her inside seat bone, push with her outside, outside leg, back and kiss and with the outside leg with the spur um, and the same thing for the other direction uh, outside leg back lift your inside seat bone push with that outside seat bone and kiss um, get him, you know, stop spur stop and back she's going to take her legs off of him off and forward not out and back like she kind of wants to do but out and forward and just slightly flag just a little bit and have her lean her upper body back. Okay. Are you using any voice command with that back? She can kiss if she wants to, um, if he's really not listening to her. Okay. Um, but just a little bit of a kiss and, you know, she just needs to tap a little bit on him. Um, but she shouldn't have to come all the way back here. She just, you know, Okay. So that, right that pressure of leaning back is... That weight shifting back yeah. and then her legs out. I mean, that's kind of the cue for him. Okay. Um, and then when she, stop, when she wants him to stop back and she needs to close her leg, close okay. that door. Okay. Um, you know, just, I think that's, that's okay. all. Can you think of anything else? Um, if you want him to pivot? Pivot. The hand is going to just be the direction. She okay. doesn't need to bring it all the way out and around. Um, we're going to the, to the left. Take your hand over and then use this outside leg. Okay. Lay that outside leg on. If he's not, you know, use your spur if he's not getting, right, getting after it. Okay. Um, and use the spur is going to give the speed coming around. So the harder she pushes, the harder he needs to go around. If she's really pushing, she needs to you know bump on him a little bit. If he's not you know stepping up, if his head comes up when he's turning around, she just needs to raise her hand up and his head will go down. Okay. Um, same thing with the other direction. If she's going to the right, have her shift her you know upper body to the right. Take her hand over and use that outside leg and bump him over again. If his head comes up, she's just going to lift straight up with her hand, not back. He'll step out if she pulls back, but just straight up, drop his head down, and continue to turn around. Okay. Um, turn on the forehand for the English. He'll do the turn on the forehand, um, and that's, you know, he'll do it one-handed or if you're sitting with the English. Okay. Um, you know, just if you're, we're turning on, on the left forehand, you're just going to hold that shoulder there with that rein. You know, don't, don't move this rein at all. Just hold that shoulder with that rein. And move his hip around with your left leg, and then the opposite for turn on the forehand on the right. Okay. Just hold that shoulder, and he'll just step right around. Okay. Um, side pass then is probably no side rain. Side pass. I mean, just lay your leg on him, and you're just gonna sit with you know that seat bone and just push him over. Okay. And you know if he starts to get, if you you'll know if your leg's too far forward or too far back because he's gonna get all cattywampus on you. Okay. So just push him over, pick that hand up just a little bit. Not as much as if she's going to turn, um, but just pick it up just to give a little bit of direction and you know, push that weight to that out, to that seat bone to push him out from underneath of you. Um, same thing for the other direction. If you want to go back the other direction, just take your hand over a little bit, you know, open that leg a little bit so he knows the direction that you're going to go in, um, and then just step him off your leg. Don't go too far back with it because then he's just going to walk around on the forehand. Okay. Um, Is it pass? Yep, that's what we were just talking about. Um, what else? Anything else? Um, yeah, it's setting him up, rolling your, yeah. rolling your spur up his belly. Um, his keys for trot and turn. Yep, just bump with your leg, kiss a little bit, or cluck a little bit for the trot. Show, kiss us, for show us your cluck. And then kiss. All right. Nice. There you go, right on cue. Yeah, good tone. Okay. Good tone. Good. Because <laughs> <Thank> she's. <laughs> yeah. oh.